were just talking about four player games. This one's four players too. Unfortunately, this game is probably the worst golf game I've ever played. Okay. Uh, level, novice, course, practice. Okay. Creating course. 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 Yeah, that title screen music is terrible. I'm not sure if they are, actually. I think they're all the same, it's just this game needs to feel like it's random, I guess. Or feel like there's something going on. You need a one wood. You need to shut up. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Not gonna work. Uh, uh. Yes. Oh, I, I forgot. You have to press start in between these. This is going to be a long ass game, so get comfy. Please don't hit the tree. You hit the tree! <sighs> this game feels slow. It is. <laughs> it is. What if I can't get comfy? It's a good question. Shoot, I didn't think anybody was going to ask me that. That's right, crabs. Now hand over the secret formula. Or what? I don't know. I didn't think I'd get this far. <laughs> get wumpy. Sounds like a you problem. Hey, better watch it. Also, that's true. I don't know if... Did this game have a Famicom version? Because if so, then maybe. Watch what? The stream too late already doing that. <clears throat> yeah, Ariel doesn't. I feel like if I hit it too hard, it might go too far. Uh, okay, we made it. Also, this game, I will say, this game has one redeeming quality. If you take way too many strokes, and you finally get the ball in the hole, the message it displays is hilarious. Inadvertently, I hope we get it at least once. Just, to, just so you guys can see it. That might not go in. Oh, it did. Sweet. It's US exclusive. I gotcha. Alright, we're three minutes into the run, and we have completed two out of 18 holes. And there's multiple courses in this game. So. <sighs> yeah. You know what's crazy about this game? You guys want to know something crazy? When I bought my cartridges this game... It was behind the counter. It wasn't even in the cheap section. My copy cost twenty dollars. I want to. Uh, make some edits to my nightbot commands or like the auto messages. A few of them are fine, but I wanna. I expect it worth yeah. It's better in Neo Turf Masters where the game just says you took too long and the golfer yells, "Oh no!" <laughs> That's that has the same energy as Wow You Lose. Try playing Jack Nicklaus Gold on SNES. Not bad, but holy crap, that horizontal loading of every screen. I have the NES uh, Jack Nicklaus game. I have not run it, but. I might. <laughs> I might. 
just to get a time, just so that we can complete this terrible challenge I'm doing, trying to speedrun 357 licensed NES games. We're at 280-something, I think, right now. Pebble Beach SNES is similarly interesting. I've not played Pebble Beach SNES. I've played the NES one. That one was fun. Not my favorite, but it was fun. The best one is NES Open Tournament Golf. And then the second best is either Pebble Beach or Black Box. <clears throat> but NES Open is by far the best one. That's in the... Yeah, that's... Oh, that's not even in the sand. We didn't even hit it that hard. Do I own any rare or expensive NES games? The most expensive game I own cost me $150, and that was Kickmaster. That is my most expensive cart. My second most expensive is Mega Man 5. That's not going in, because I, I didn't angle this right. Oh, it did go in. Never mind, call me surprised. Hell, I could probably go get the Kickmaster cart to show you, just... <laughs> There's so much waiting around in this game. I could probably go look, go get it and show you, but not, not right, not right now. Let me, just in case. Plus, I don't want to like hurry over there and grab it and then accidentally drop it and I break it and it shatters into a million pieces and then my house catches on fire and then I throw up. <laughs> Pulls out Nintendo World Championship cart. No, I don't have that. I'm probably not ever going to get that. You want to know what's wild, though? You want to know the wildest story I've ever heard about Nintendo World Championships? So there's this uh, game store uh, based in Washington called Pink Gorilla, and they take like used games and stuff, and they sell used games and old games and retro stuff and whatnot, and new stuff, too. Um, but... They also have, like, a very vast range of, like, Famicom, Super Famicom, Japanese PlayStation, Sega Saturn, all that kind of, all that kind of stuff they've got. They used to have a copy of Nintendo World Championships. They got one in the store because some guy came in and just brought in a bunch of random NES games that he had stowed in his attic or something. And he was going to sell them. And they were pulling each one out, and like each, you know, it's just like your standard stuff, like a couple sports games, but then, you know, a couple interesting ones, some, you know, classic Nintendo games. But then they pulled out Nintendo World Championships, which is known to only have like a hundred something copies. And they were straight up like, you know, they were, <laughs> at first they thought it was a joke, but then they asked the customer, it's like, do you know like what this is? He's like, no, I have no idea. Because the guy was just like, oh, I just collected random stuff back in the day. He had no idea how valuable that was. Uh, and they asked him, it's like, where did you get this? Like, how how do you have a copy of Nintendo World Championships? And he said he just, like, would collect them randomly. And he, I guess, like, it was like a, in a yard sale or something. And so he got, like, t you know, 10 grand <laughs> for his copy. Within a day, it sold to somebody else. <laughs> so yeah, imagine going, oh, I'll just get like a hundred bucks for these, maybe. Maybe. Oh, ten grand, perfect, cool. <laughs> oh, come on, man, really? What is this? Come on! Why, where are you going? Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm confused. I don't know what's going on. Please give me the message when I get this in. Oh my god! Are y'all seeing this? What is going on? That's too much. That's not gonna go in. That's too much. Yeah, I, I, I overshot at that time. A Zelda Game & Watch. Nice. Oh my gosh. What is happening, guys? I can't, I can't get it. Oh, finally. Yes! Okay. <laughs> Disaster. 
<laughs> Disaster. <laughs> It doesn't even say just like, oh, plus 10 or whatever. It says, disaster. <laughs> oh, you ping me in memes? Okay, I'll take a look at it. Uh, actually, I could probably do that after I clear this hole. Or hang on, hang on. Let me just... You must give up playing this hole. Hang on, let me open it, but I'll... It's, it's muted anyways. We're fine. Why am I getting an ad? What? It is muted, right? It is. Oh no! <laughs> how do I how do I have ads on here? What? The doe face, I know. Oh my god, come on. You must give up playing this hole. I don't know. Okay, par. Dude, we're only on hole eight. And it's been 11 minutes. Dude, I could have done two runs of Pebble Beach or one run of either Black Box or NES Open. Three of Galf, probably. Probably four or five. <laughs> Galf is a game. Yeah, yeah, Galf. Ugh. Damn it. Those are black holes dilating space time. Yeah, I. Galf sure was a game. You know what's sad is that Galf is gonna get into the next Big 20 just because it's fast. And they're gonna say, oh yeah, golf games are really bad and really slow, but golf is super fast. You'll be done in two minutes. Okay, hang on. Namco Classic. I have not heard of that. Okay, hang on, just stop there, stop there. Yes, okay. This should go in. Boom. Double bogey. At least it's not disaster. <laughs> oh, man. Can this game just, like, I don't know, be better? <laughs> yes. Did I hit the tree? I did not. Okay. I thought I hit the tree. <clears throat> I will say as much as much as I'm making fun of this game at least it's completable without too much trouble like if you're just trying to beat this game it's free if you're trying to do it fast good luck uh okay I'm still on the rough <clears throat> Man.
<laughs> oh no! Which oh no is better, that oh no or Tim Allen? Oh no! Dude, I feel like I'm gonna fall asleep. Knuckles, oh no. <clears throat> now the best, though, the absolute best is oh god, oh man. That's the best. Oh, that's that's gonna that's gonna miss. I think. No, never mind. We got it. <laughs> you could fall asleep and still beat the run, probably. I'm trying to decide what I'll play after this. We might play Last Action Hero after this, just so that we can play something that's not a sports game or you know whatever. We might play that. There's one game that I'm purposely going to save for last just because I'm a little concerned about if I'm even going to be able to beat it. <laughs> Which, it's going to sound silly, but it's, it's true. Out of bounds, screw you. I'm taking this game back to the retro game store. Incurs a penalty stroke? That should be better, yeah? <clears throat> yeah, that's, that's, that's better. Come on, stop. Okay, good. <clears throat> God, imagine this game in a big 20. This would take forever. Unless they did beat hole 3. <laughs> but even then, it's like you're kind of just wasting... Like, that's a waste of a, a game. As the last game. Oh my god, this, that. Okay, that would be funny, actually. They'll never do that, though, because... You're not even allowed to joke about games that are in the list. You can't even make a joke about the quality of the game. <clears throat> well, actually, let me rephrase that. You, you can't do that anymore. How about that? Don't give them any ideas. Trust me, I've tried giving them ideas, and I get ignored every time. I get shafted all the time. That's why I actually left the Big 20 Discord. Because I'm like, what's the point? I'm never going to do any of these anymore. And plus, anytime I try to talk about how new games should be prioritized, I just get shafted. <clears throat> what's the point, you know? <clears throat> just time to move on. Just not bother. The one time you give them a bad idea, they're going to take it, probably. Did I hit the tree? Yeah, I did. I hit the tree. Interesting. Okay. Huh. I'm not sure how to deal with this. I don't remember if anything I've ever recommended. Yeah, I don't think anything I've ever recommended has ever made it into a, a list. Which is funny, because even... T you know, I've said some things about Tiny Ten, but at least some of the games that I've recommended, at least some of those made it in, you know? Like, at least they took some of my criticism seriously, you know? I, I can give him some, I can give him an edge there. Ariel didn't have to put Michael Jordan in the, not the recent Super 16, but the one before. He didn't have to, but he did anyways. And then everybody hated it except for me and one other person. <laughs> That might be too far, I'm not sure. I don't know, I'm gonna be honest, I like this project more. They do ask the runners. Dude, I'm gonna be honest, just for your sake, just for your sake, I hope the next Tiny 10 is just a good list. Like, even if it's on the same level as like 11. 11 was an okay list. Like, even if they just do that, that's a safe bet, honestly. Like, just make something solid. You take a list like 12. I gotcha. Yeah, I heard 12 was okay, too. But then again, it had freaking Wayne's World in it. Alright. I think we'll do Last Action Hero after this so that we can play something exciting. <laughs> Um, and then after that we might play a silly pinball game, and then I'll play something else. Yep, I learned Last Action Hero last night, actually. Well, I say learned it, but there's no real learning, you just have- it's- it's luck, 
I'll be honest, it's just luck. <clears throat> yeah, the Game Boy version, yeah. Just not 13 or 8. Yeah. <clears throat> Tiny 10 8. That was the only list I ever... That's the only multi-game race I ever forfeited. But let me tell you, there have been a couple other races where I considered forfeiting, but I kept going. Big 2011? Funnily enough, Super 16, number 6. After Pock and Rocky 2, I was so done. I was so mad. But I kept going, and somehow we pulled off the biggest comeback in multi-game race history. Oh, man. Is that gonna do it? Nice. Yeah, the best Tiny 10s were 4, 5, 7 and 10, and then 11 was okay. <clears throat> Honestly, I think 6, except Double Dragon, I think 6 is actually better now. It was just not the right time at the time to do it. I think it would have actually been a good list today. Just at the time, it just didn't work. I think that list aged the best. Except Double Dragon. If you take that out and... Dude, take out Double Dragon and put anything in there. Anything else. Put in Spearu or something. Like, do that. And there we go. R-Type 1 is terrible. R-Type 2 is better. R-Type 1 is really bad. <laughs> I don't know why, either. Like... <laughs> I mean, they at least the developers fixed R-Type 2 to actually be good. But still, like... I remember there was a discussion on if R-Type 2 should be in a Tiny 10, and all I asked was, is it better than R-Type 1? Is it actually good? And I was told yes. And that is true. So here's the thing, if I get a water hazard, I need to press B, because look at my options. B to drop the ball, A to replay the shot. Always drop it, just drop it. Put it where it's supposed to go, because it's always going to be closer. Incurs a penalty stroke, I'm going to fight you. Come on. Okay, there we go. I don't remember when time ends on this game. <laughs> I think it ends as soon as the ball goes in the hole on the last one. I think. I have no idea. I don't even know where I am anymore. I'm just kind of... I can't believe I'm... Honestly, I'm just in disbelief that I'm even playing this game. If this game was faster, and it didn't load 100,000 years, and you could skip this, this game would be better. A lot better. Still not great, but it would be better. That was pathetic. <laughs> Three hundred yards from the hole. An eight iron, I know. I'm surprised it didn't hit the tree, actually. Landed in a bunker. I don't think that's even going to get out. No, it did. Kind of had a weird angle there, though. Nice. Just barely. <laughs> okay, three more holes and then we can play something else. Three more, guys. <clears throat> Alright, come on. We can do this. We can do this. This is the longest golf game in the entire history of the world. That includes everything from in real life stuff. Like, actual golf matches. They're not as long as this game. 35 more minutes! Probably, now that I hit a freaking tree. <laughs> <sighs> Welcome to my life.
one shitty game after another shitty game after bullshit games and what the fuck, man? <laughs> oh, good old TMR. Ah. The ball is lost in water. I can't do what TMR did though with his Nest Mania. I can't do it. Like, I can't. I can't beat every single NES game. That's just out of my repertoire, I guess. <clears throat> disaster! <laughs> That's only the second disaster in the game so far. <laughs> uh. Also, I didn't even know who Greg Norman was until I found this cartridge of this game. I felt kind of bad, but to be fair, this was... This game really... Every single NES game, except for, like, the homebrews, every, li every licensed NES game and Famicom game released before I even existed. I was born one day after Super Mario 64 released in Japan. I am older than a handful of SNES games, and I am older than every Nintendo 64 game. And then everything after that, I'm older than. For example, Frogger, Super Nintendo, Donkey Kong Country 3, and I think uh, Kirby, there's like a Kirby game on Super Nintendo. Those I'm actually older than. Those released after me. Oh man. Oh crap. Kirby! Alright, one more hole guys, one more. I, I think the time ends as soon as you get the whole the ball in the last hole, I think. I'm gonna hope that's when it is, because that way I can at least try to go for a sub-30. World record on this category, I think, is uh, just under 21 minutes. I still loved when I was revealing the 4040 games. Arcadia got so hyped when I revealed that I was going to do Kirby's Adventure <laughs> for the challenge. Please go in. I think that's it. If not, I'll retime it, but yeah, that's it. That's the game, finally. We're done. Oh, I am done now. We just, we literally just finished. <laughs> there we go. <sighs> God, I'm I'm dripping in sweat. <laughs>